Welcome to Prevent Your Adventure. Um, it's a Thursday night. It's a little different. It's supposed to be a storm coming in this weekend, so I thought let's get out on a Thursday just in case I can't get out on a Sunday. And uh, not an interesting story there at all, was it? So tonight I am in Baltic, Connecticut. Now the building I've been to before, but it's new owners. I was just sitting on my tablet today going through looking for some places to go that were kind of close for a Thursday night uh, and I ran across this place and it's called More Pizza M-O-O-R-E and from what I understand talking there's two women working inside oh, sorry there's a reflection there so talking to the two women inside they uh the owner's not here, and one's her future daughter-in-law, and one's her cousin. It's just the three of them that run it. So let me show you what I got. I got a small meatball grinder, or sub, depending on what part of the country you're from. And all I have is small pizza, so I got a small pepperoni pizza. Just, just to have a couple different things to try. Once again, I'll be all set for tomorrow night's supper also. thing is... Uh, thing is heavy. It's very loaded. First bite and I'm wearing it. So I got it with onions and peppers. Not sure why. I mean, I like onions and peppers, but... It's a very nice grinder. Piece of meatball just fell out. Let's see if I can show that to you. Nice and soft and tender. Nice flavor to it. It's a nice package. I'm not sure I'd be crazy about the meatballs as a standalone, but in that nicely toasted bread with the other stuff it comes across very nicely here's the pizza and it's a it's a pan pizza Trying to be able to describe the crust for you here. It's a nice crust. It's light and airy. I'm not going to say it has a crisp on the bottom, but it has, and I mean this in a good way, it's not a bad way, but a little, it's a little tougher, a little stronger. But a nice piece of pizza. Nice piece of pizza. A lot of a lot of pepperoni on that thing. Okay. First impression is pretty nicely done. Let me finish up and come back and give you my final thoughts. Okay, final thoughts from more pizza here in Baltic, Connecticut. Um, let's start off with the two women that were working here. They were just having a good time in there. They were, they were uh, very pleasant, very, very nice. Uh, one woman came out and she was explaining to me how it's a small town here and everyone knows everyone and the whole town kind of shuts down at seven o'clock. They're lucky if they see a car go by after that, but 
Uh, just really nice to talk to. They're very friendly, very outgoing. Place has been here a year and a half. Excuse me. So, let's talk about the food. First off, that grinder was loaded. There's nothing more they could have fit in that bread. They, they really pack it up a lot. And it was very, very nicely done. Good flavor. Nice meatballs. Um, filler used in the meatballs, but that's not such a big deal when it's in a sandwich with bread and other stuff. Uh, and, it, and it just was very, as, as a package, it was really enjoyable. Very nice. The pizza was nice. Uh, nice crust. Nice sauce. Typical pan Greek style pizza. Uh, quite a bit of cheese. More cheese than I would get into, but that's how it's done, and that's okay. It's, it still came across very nicely. Just a nice product. Really nicely done. Between the pizza, the meatball sandwich, the people working here, just a really pleasant experience overall. Um, I enjoyed it. I would come back. <clears throat> if I was a coming back type of guy. So let's give it a score. 0 to 10. Moore's Pizza. I think it used to be Sharky's Pizza, if anyone knows the area. But it's it's uh, all new owner, all new stuff they're doing here. Now Moore's Pizza. Good, good all around, good all around experience. Very enjoyable. So, zero to ten. Let's go, um, let's go 8.1. I liked it. I did. It, it was, it was a good experience. So 8.1, nice, nice fair score. Solid score. More pizza here in, uh, Baltic, Connecticut. I didn't give any thought to telling you any other things, any stories, but I, I, so I'll give you a really quick one. It has no excitement, no no ending, no anything, just a story. As I was driving down, I, I, I live north of here. I come down Interstate 395, and I was thinking about... I was in high school at the time. I was driving, but in high school. So driving my mother's car, I didn't have my own car. I don't know what I was coming down here for. Might have been a... Uh, carnival of sorts that I might have talked about in a previous video where I was trying to impress a girl and trying to win her something and I have no talent. In 1973 dollars I spent $25 and walked away with nothing which would be $75 to $100 now. Not too smart. But anyhow. I, on the way down here I had a friend that was coming also. He had his mother's car, his father's car. I'm not sure which parent. And uh, he had a Chevy Malibu or something with a big V8. And I had my mother's Chevy Nova with a V6. And we're driving down at whatever speed. We're going certainly faster than we should have been. And came upon my brother-in-law. And his brother-in-law driving the same direction. They weren't going where we were going, but we, I pulled up alongside him and waved at him, and he had a V8 also in a Plymouth Duster, and he looked at me, and he just shrugged and floored it, and off he went. So my friend jumped right on him, and he's following him, and those guys are taking off, and I'm pushing his V6 I'm in, and I don't think it went any faster than 95, so they're pulling away from me, and thankfully, no one got hurt, no one got pulled over, and... Um, Three not very intelligent drivers, young but not very intelligent drivers, driving down the road. Um, we were bad to begin with, but got worse when my brother-in-law took off, and we thought we had to keep up. So anyhow, there's, there's my story. For those of you keeping track, my very first bite, I spilled it on myself, so um, it's there, even though it doesn't show up under this light, maybe. So Jeffrey, my boy Jeffrey, who likes to keep track of my spills, I know he's uh, going to enjoy that. 
That meatball sandwich got me good. So there you go. More pizza in Baltic, Connecticut. I really need to do better with that. More pizza, Baltic, Connecticut, 8.1.